Good morning from Mexico. I've just watch, washed this spinach and this parsley, as well as there is some sprouts and there is this nopale, nopals, nopal, what to call it, like cactus, because I'm gonna prepare a green juice. I'm gonna put this up here as well, which is celery sticks and cucumber, orange juice, which is already squeezed and freshly made. It's ready. Can you see that color? Uh, yeah. Okay, time to pour it. Oh my, I still have some spinaches which haven't been shaked. However, this is the final result. Cheers to the life. So here we have a school of Kung Fu, Tai Chi, and Chinese and Japanese. So yeah, there is available these disciplines here in Mexico, Guadalajara too. And there it says like Chinese and Japanese classes, all levels and all ages, trips to China, India and Japan. Good morning for you all. My name is Norcaria from the beautiful city of Guadalajara. I'm too, super happy today. <laughs> Starting a beautiful week here. I wish you the best for all of you. Some cheeses here. I came to a grocery shop and soon I'll show you what is inside. It's not vegan, it's for my mom. But anyways, um, I have to tell you that this morning I went to therapy. I'm taking a physical therapy for my leg because I've hurt it. I believe it was last year taking a yoga class in China. And after I kept walking for very long distances in China and it just got a little bit worse and chronic, but I think it's healing very good. So, so far it's fine. And I'm super uh, relief that I can get over this soon and I'll be back to China and be able to walk that much you know you cannot imagine but I really love to walk so long in China like there was one time it's exactly was last year when I went back to China after Mexico when I walked for like one day 46 km like 46 kilometers in one day because I am passionate about walking in China and I used to have a super strong and beautiful legs when I was younger when I just went to China when I was 21 10 years ago nine years ago and my hobby was just walking around and discovering China hopefully I can do that again and then I'll take my phone and show you all around I know by heart Beijing and Shenzhen which were my places and places where I was rambling all around but there's no more time to talk and I have to show you the groceries that we can find in this shop right here Mexican kind of uh, home food ready to go so come with me this is the outfit for today I bought this little blouse on Singapore my trip by the way still have some Singapore vlogs which I have in the below for you all so let's check this out, what we can find here. So basically they prepare like home style food and people come and pick it up, it's ready to go and eat. For those people who are not able to cook for any situation, whether it's time or they just want to take delivery, this is chicken and there is potatoes and this is pasta and beans of course none of this food is like food for me but i just came to company mom because she's gonna buy something for her and these are like tacos fried tacos chicken cheese and meat there is some cake uh, of course we have a lot of cheeses and there is beans and this is very popular in mexico is arroz con leche which is milk and rice it's a sweet dessert and we have this which i believe it's paella or just rice with meats and vegetables that is like a big pizza yeah i don't know the name of it can you see that super big like my hand super big and that is a salad oh by the way there are some more available here like this salad and i'm not gonna buy salad because i like to prepare it myself there's this rice in mexico we eat these styles of rice not like in china that is just steamed we eat like this one which has a little bit of oil and vegetables 
white rice and red rice. It's called like white rice or red rice. If you try it, maybe you like it. And there is also that green sauce. Meat. And people is paying here for their stuff. They sell also tortilla because everybody eats tortilla during the meal time. And wow, they have so much more food. Chicken, taco, flauta. I don't know, it's some kind of taco. Maybe this is gonna be the taco dorado, fried taco. And oh my god, look at this cheese, it's super big. I tell you, Mexicans are super fanatic of cheese. Can you see that? It's so thick on my head. It's like super huge. You have to see the size of this cheese. <laughs> so big. And then we have more tortillas over here and a lot of different kind of cheeses because as you have seen my previous vlog, I've told you that Mexicans will love cheese. All kind of cheeses. There are so many like Manchego, Gouda, Queso Menonita, Chihuahua, uh, Gouda, Manchego Cheddar. They are so different styles, you know? Even this American cheese. And there were some other stuff. So I wonder what is this? Weird. I don't know. You see this Oaxaca cheese, which is like a flexible thing. This is lima juice. I don't know if you have ever heard of this fruit, but I don't know if it's available. I don't. I didn't see it in China. I don't know if you know about this fruit, but it's very popular here in Guadalajara. I've never seen this fruit in China or this lima juice in China. It's super refreshing. It tastes a little bit like sweet lemon. That would be the more close similarity to lima taste. Thursday with life. Look at this lima juice from Guadalajara, Jalisco. I have no idea if you know what is this fruit, but it's delicious. And this is the streets of my city. Thursday with life. And the chef and there is like a even graduation gone in here which is pretty cute and the football soccer outfits and there is like super woman i guess and of course we have the our china panda here with its own garment <laughs> so funny and there is a giraffe getting married in there as well as an elephant uh, an elephant that is a nurse. Look at her. Oh, her shoes. No, oh, this is beautiful. The mouse. And there is this crabs and those ones. Oh my god, everything is so cute. Look at this. Amazing. And of course, we couldn't miss the Mexican traditional dress doll. Oh, this one is beautiful with that flower, tiara. And there is a mermaid over there. So nice. Guys, look at this. This is like the worst drop. Oh my god, how cute is this? Pure cuteness. Look at this princess. These trousers, oh my god, they are so cute. <laughs> oh my god. They have even overalls. No, 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 no. <laughs> so cute and <laughs> with the skirts. <laughs> this <is> skirt. <laughs> Mini skirt. So cute to be treated seriously. Oh, here we have shoes. <laughs> Look at these shoes. <laughs> so cute. And oh those shoes are so nice. 
especially these ones. They look like, you know, pyjama outfits. These are the cutest ever. I've never seen this place before, but it's just the cutest to be true. Giraffe, dog ones, even frog. Oh my god, rain boots. The cute. Too cute. We also have sandals. Can you imagine we have sandals? Los <laughs> andalios. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they are so funny. They're so fashionable. Look at these sandals. They're too really too cute. And tennis to play soccer. This tennis. Oh my. Mama, look at this. <laughs> For football and soccer. So cuties. Oh Guys, you have to look at this. This is the raincoat. Can you imagine? So beautiful. And the boots are here. Look at this outfit. So cute shoes. This is like a dancer garment. And oh, it's like palette one. So beautiful. Good night. This is the pyjamas. Pyjamas. It's too cute, really. Those clothes. Let's take a look. I didn't even see this in China, oh, this dress, but I saw something similar in Japan, actually. Toto, so beautiful. Look at these shoes, oh my god, they're so cute. Summer clothes. That elephant is so beautiful. And I like this one over here, this one. The shoes are so fashionable. So what do you think about the overall? We even have them here. Guys, we have some polo shirts in here. Look at these polo shirts. And we have some cups. I am a cup lover, so we have some cups. Oh my god, it's cute. So basically here is the material that the dolls are made of. And kids purchase a doll and they will just they stuff the doll and after they can purchase some clothes for it so that's kind of the business model uh, this is a camping tent for those who want to go camping it's super beautiful Seriously. so basically here the children can stuff their dolls and put them some clothes because as you see they are kind of naked and they don't have any stuffing and you can choose from all these models over here many designs and each and every one, it's just have stuff, which is like the heavy stuff, and the rest is naked and unstuffed. And that's the working place where the kids will really stuff the doll. And after they can just choose the clothes. They have even glue. Some glue. Oh my god. Everything is cute. Look at this saying, quiero ser tu amigo, be my friend. <laughs> so nice. Yeah. So cute. A big thumbs up for this video, please. Cute one. Vegan sushi and there's some avocado, carrots, cucumber, seaweed, rice, soy sauce and spring onions etc. So this is the way to that.